ಓಂ ಶಿವಾಯ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ ಓಂ ನಮ ಶಿವಾಯ Sunday morning at the beach always nice and quiet all the rascals are still asleep with a hangover <laughs> but really there are places i can just walk a little ways and there's nobody even at peak hours i just like the big sky the waves The few people that are down here in the early morning are mainly exercisers, walkers, runners, swimmers. People who are here to do something, not just hang out and cause trouble. <laughs> so anyway, this is my hangout. Well, I don't cause any trouble. I come down here and meditate, do yoga, swim. As soon as it gets a little hotter, I'll go in swimming. But anyway, it's December now, end of the year. And uh like the end of every year towards the uh winter solstice, it's a good time to look back and take stock, evaluate the progress of this year and uh see how we can improve things. And as usual, I'm going to take a break around winter solstice. Uh I've reached a nice ending off point in both of the series that we're currently producing, the Mandukya Upanishad and the Shiv Purana. So, I'm going to leave you with those. And also the hint that we're working on something big for next year. uh we're going to repackage and rebrand the teaching to hopefully make it more accessible so the teaching as it is is just fine it works great the problem is it's couched in the esoteric language of the sanskrit scriptures and a lot of people have trouble with that so we're going to be looking at putting it into a more approachable context so that more people can take advantage and get the benefits so see you next year aung tat sat aung shakti aung aung namah shivaya